නම විදුවල්පති තුමිය ආසිර ගැන්වීමේ දේව මෙහෙයට සුදතුම් වරම් යදිමින් පොල්තෙල් පහන් දැල්වීමටයි මේ අපගේ සූදානම කොළඹ දියෝකීසේ සභා ඉඳේ රානන්වන අතිගරු දුෂ්‍යන්ත රොද්දුගු රදගුරු හිමිපාණනි පහන් වැටියත් දල්වා මේ මොහොත ඒ කාලෝකවත් කිරීමට ඔබ වහන්සේටයි අපගේ ගෞරවනීය පළමු ඇරයුම අප දේවස්ථානයේ කුලාචාර්ය ගරු සාගර පෙරේරා පියතුමනි පහන් වැටියත් දල්වා මෙම අවස්ථාව ආසිරි ගැන්වීමට ඔබතුමානන්ටයි අපගේ මේ ළඟ ඇරයුම මේ අවස්ථාව වර්ණවත් කරමින් පහන් වැටි දැල්වීමට විධායක කමිටුවේ සභාපති ශ්‍රී අබේවර්ධන මැතිතුමාටත් සද්මලාන අන්ධ විද්‍යාලයේ කලමනාකාර නිරෝෂ්ද සිල්වා මහතාටත් විහිර විද්‍යාලයේ කලමනාකාරීනි ශෛලෝමි ගුණවර්ධන මෙනවියටත් ඇරයුම් කරමු අප පාස අප පාසල් වල නව විදුහල් ප්‍රතිනිලේ සපත්වන රොසානා කුලේන්ද්‍රන් මෙනවියටත් ආදරයෙන් ඇරයුම් කරමු දල්වන්නට පහන් වැටි මේ ළඟට අප පාසල් නියෝජනය කරමින් පහන් වැටි දැල්වීමට සුරණි ප්‍රනාන්දු මහත්මියටත් තේපාලිකා මනම්පේරි මහත්මියටත් ඇරයුම් කරමු
अमो तो आगे न एकले ओबा गोस बो साथ पेपाल फावते न पिने साथ आगे नामे न ओबा पियाना न वाहन से गे नीला न खावर दया कुआं द वाहन से ओबा डे न पिने देविदोंट आशीर्वेवा इनविटेशन टू अब गे पावे नब मुदा गनी म पिनिस सह स्वर्ग यही अब वेन वेन में दाहत खार काम करांट न तात तात न चुने करागे ने आंटा देवयानुहान से स्पर्की एक जाद के पुत्र यानं दिनतराम लोकयाद प्रेम कल एक मनिसा अपसा दाहवेन मनस तापुने वी देवयानुहान से के आंख न्यावा नानुवा मनुष्यान सामग प्रेमेन सा सामेन चे वात वे मट अधितान करे काने मु अभी महोताक दिनत प्यागे न देवेश्वामेन वाहन से अभी ऐसे सिटे काने मु विसामी दुन्ट विरुद्ध वात वाहन से के मेवील लड़ विरुद्ध वात क्या साल वास इंट विरुद्ध वात अभी सिते इन वाचने इन क्रिया वेन कलाओ पापे आन अपने नहीं करा मु अभी एक वक्त क्या मो दया करुणा वे देवते वाहन से डरुद्ध वा अबे किन्हीं कार्य डरुद्ध वा इतने वाचने ना से आवेद वाहन से के में भी लड़ डरुद्ध वा दा के नो दुर्वात का महादुर्वल का मनिसात बालवाता के कर का मनिसात उपाव कराए दिवावे वाहन से तो सा साउदर साउदर यान का आप चार ने करामु अभी से भाई मकान गाड़ हुए मु अधीते सिद्धो पावल्ड समावे बिन रिस्तुन वाहन से तुले आव जीवित है डा पैतुलात करने में क्या क्या कर Anugrahina karuna wen purna dewi dano, prasama wadane kara silupa wen oba muda, nawa jiw kita kali ada, saat kan anugraha sanat, kita dana karna. Dewa ni pitu eh ti benar surat dua tegi ya, kaya nak keramu.
ुतिवंतमो मलेये मे मुलुसेनगत्गिट मिसीन ओंट एना ईश्रायल पुत्र अंट दिन देश अट मे योर्दांगतरव युबला अडियता बन यलुमस्तान मिसीन मोसेस्ट कीलेस नुबलाट दुनिमी कांतार मे लो लेबन पटान महागंगाव वन युप्रतीस गंगाव दाक्वा एति स्त्री वरुणे मुलुराटद महामूद दाक्वाद नुबलागे देश सीमा वनुत दिव्यति नुबलाट विरुद्धव किसी वेकुट नगी सिटीनट नुह किय मम मोसे सामग याकमेन नुब सामगा सिटीनेमी मम नुब केरेन अहक्वयान्नेवात नुब अत्थरिन्नेवात नेत शक्ति मात्तद दहिर्य वांधवद सिटिन्न मांद मे सेनगट देन हटियट मा ओउन्गे पिय वरुन्ट दिवल देशय नुब ओउन्ट उरुमकट देन नेहिय मागे सेवक मोसेस अनकल सियलु नीति अनुव क्रिया किरीमट वग क्रिया किरीमट बला गण्णा लेस शक्ति मतद धैर्य मतद नुबयान यान तेम तेन दीम नुबट यवन पिनीत इम नीति अकुरटम पिलिपादीन मे नीति संग्रहाय पितरम युतुय एलियातिबेन भावनाटदेदान एम तनक अमिदान महांसी लोक 
Church of God, we pray that you will speak and we, your servants, will be made to listen and to hear and stop our ears. In your name we pray. Amen. Be seated, please. I was quite taken aback. When I was told that I had to preach at this service. Because usually I'm not the kind of preacher that fits in so very easily. And so I thought for one whole day as to why I should be preaching at this service. And then I found a good reason for that. And that was because when you and I were on the staff for a very short time that I spent at Mount Lavinia, that we disagreed upon everything and couldn't find common ground on any of the areas that we worked together. So I thought that truly must be the reason as to why I should be preaching at this service. First of all, let me see how courageous you are to decide to lead these two schools. In fact, the board was looking for people and they asked others and probably they didn't find the courage to say yes. 
but probably because you are coming from the Sabapati Kulendran clan, who was himself a pioneer, the first bishop of the Diocese of Jaffna of the Church of South India, that gave you the courage to say yes. It's difficult to preach at a service such as this because we take far too many things for granted and many things are easier said than done. If I sound as if I am preaching, stop me because it's not going to help you anyway. Task so mammoth that preaching will not help. This portion of scripture taken from the book of Joshua was chosen by you. And you may have had a good reason for having chosen it. But it's a seldom used passage because there is a call of so many prophets in the Bible that is so used in services and sermons that we had hardly used the call of Joshua. And as I reflected on it and tried to prepare some words out of it, I found that, well, if you chose it, then you ought to hear it and try and live by it. First of all, there seems to be a condition. Be careful, it says, to act in accordance with all the law that my servant Moses commanded you. There is a very clear condition. As you take on the mantle of this, these two schools, you know that there has been a school before you entered a community that already exists. You don't bring the community with you. And God is telling Joshua that. Joshua had been the vice principal of Moses. But yet he needed to be reminded that it is in Moses that God's favor was in, and that the people looked up to Moses and to no one else. And so you are reminded this morning, Rosanna, that there's been a school before you came here. There's been a staff who is already well entrenched in the system, and sometimes too well entrenched, that they can create more trouble and have work for you than good. The people of Israel came out just as people. The people of Israel came out of Egypt just as some crowd. But on the way, they became a nation. A crowd becomes a nation. So the community to which you are now beginning your work and you are giving expression to are people who came from different backgrounds and came here and received an identity. Unfortunately, the students are not here. And I don't believe 
that I should be even standing here because there are no students. But circumstances are such that I have to give in. And so God is placing upon your heart to re remind you that there has been principals and people and founders and architects, pioneers that have built this, these schools. We have two schools. Very rare that the principal begins to give leadership to two schools at the same time. But in the wisdom of those who have served this school, there is only one chapel. And the people who donated this chapel wanted it to be so. Probably they had the money, the finances to build two chapels like this. One for you and one for me. And you know how the, the divisions go these days. But they built one chapel. So that's the point of unity. Don't look at the divisions but look at the unity that is provided. And that unity is found only in this chapel. And Moses provided that unity. It was difficult. It was cursed. It was scolded. He withdrew from him. He ran to God several times back and forth. But Yet, his task was fulfilled. We look at Moses' life and say, what a shame he couldn't enter into the promised land. But that was not his task. And you do not know when you will have to stop. Therefore, put into your effort a 100%. That if you have to stop tomorrow, there will be no regret. You can go on to the full term that is given to you. So be it. But at any given point of time, you must remember that your labors are not by yourself, but that there have been Moseses before you. But God doesn't give conditions without assurances and promises. And God tells Joshua, I will be with you. And we have heard that through all the callings of the prophet. When the prophet is saying, no, I want to run away. I'm not the one suited for the job. God can only say, I will be with you. I will not fail you or forsake you. And Rosanna, I know that you have the spirituality to draw out of what you have been built up. So that you will be assured and go with the assurance that God will never forsake you. But God doesn't say that the road is going to be easy. God is not going to say, God is not telling Joshua, you are going to find favor in the sight of all your people. That they are going to do exactly what you are saying. That there is not going to be a difference in opinion. God is saying, I will be with you. And that must be sufficient. 
has been for all of us. And probably you have drawn from that well of spirituality. But there is an expectation. And the expectation is said three times. Twice quite the same, and once quite different. In verse 6 of that passage that you alone have chosen, so don't blame me. I'm not saying anything that I have chosen. You have chosen it. Be strong and courageous. I don't know why God is saying how to say that three times in just nine verses. Be strong and courageous. Because God probably knew that what Moses went through. You probably have heard what the other principals have gone through. They probably will tell you the wrong things. They'll tell you the things that hurt them most. They'll tell you the people that are the most troublesome in the school. Yeah, I think it's about 98%. Uh, they will tell you what can't be done. And probably you are getting into it with a lot of negativity. And that's why, because Joshua was taking on a crowd that was now being fashioned and formed to be a nation, that God is telling Joshua there's no other way. There's no other way you can't run away. Be strong and courageous. And in verse 7, the next verse again, God seems to say, I don't said enough, I need to say it again. Only be strong and courage and, and very courageous. So when you find that people are not agreeing with you, that does not mean that you need to stop if you think, if you are convinced that you are doing something. You may have to shelve it for a little while, taking a, take it up again. Maybe it's not the opportune moment. And sometimes it is. It's good for you to float the idea for a long time. And let it take heart and go right down into the heart and the minds of the community before you can take it up again. And in verse 9, God seems to be saying it again. I command you, he says. So it's not, but God would have preferred you to be, but what God wants you to be. I command you. It seems that God knows that it's going to be really difficult. And as we know from the scriptures, Joshua's task was as difficult uh, as Moses's was. I command you, God says. Be strong and courageous. Do not be frightened or dismayed. I remember when I was a student leader uh, in the seminary, there was a huge problem that I had to face. A very senior priest who was very close to me came one morning. And I told, and, he to, and I told him, I sat him down and I told him all my problems. I told him, I want, I think it's time for me to step down. And he told me one thing. So he told me, you can't lead in fear. Either you lead or you get out of the way. Your task is to be the eyes, the vision, the sun, the ears and the voice to others. And through and to all, you have to be the chief interpreter of things. Life. But 
But Jesus is not going to leave you there, Rosanna. He's going to make life a little more tougher for you than what God made for Joshua. And we are at the beginning of Lent. And so it is customary for us to use Lenten reflections and readings and so on. And so today's reading is a huge challenge. Jesus is speaking about his own death. And he's not saying, when I die, everything will be all right for you. Don't worry. Of course, he says, when I lift it up, I will draw all people to myself. And so but in this particular passage, he said, that you need to understand that you are inviting death. But Jesus goes further. Death is a positive thing, isn't it? The end of suffering. So we know that we understand death as a very positive the word positive is really a negative thing, no? <laughs> the positive which you are. But doesn't matter. Where death is concerned in the Christian terms, it's, it's being that which is enriching. But that's not what Jesus is trying to say. That's his death. But he's turning to his disciples and saying, if you want to be my disciple, Take up your cross daily and follow me. And so, welcome aboard. So you are being inducted at the right time, at the, at the beginning of Lent. Someone said, it's Lent, why don't we shift it and all? I said, no, 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 that's the best time. But you can't get out of it now, Rosanna. It's Lent, you were chosen Joshua, reading, and you can't help but hear what Jesus has to say. Take up your cross daily and follow him. Go so that. And only if you are able to do it courageously, you will be able to see and participate in the resurrection. All the very best. Be assured of our prayers. <laughs> That's the easiest thing to do. And be courageous and be strong. Now we do all put in here. When we ask it again, we may do me as on the half family. Wagema Tamaharabara Swami Nuhan Sigi Vachane, Napiva Poshane Kalau, Pagadio Kesi, Indera Anand Vana, Atigaru Dushanta Rodrigo Raduguru Ananta, Magestutia Mama Memohate, Pirinamana Kemati. Shall we stand with the affirmation of our Christian faith? Found in page number four. We believe in God the Father, from whom every family in heaven and earth is named. In God the Son, who lives in our hearts through faith and fills us with love. We believe in God the Holy Spirit, who strengthens us with power from high. We believe in one God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Intercessions. Madahatyadum.
correspond. Let our cry come unto God. Let us reverend of Colombo, Father Sagar Pereira and all other leaders who are at service of our Lord and other servants that they may serve with courage and humility. Lord, hear our prayer. Let Can our I cry come, come unto you. Let us pray for the newly appointed people, children of the schools, education, and the teachers. Guide them with unending. Lord, hear our prayer. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, pray for COVID as it is spreading, extending in our country and all over the world and pray. We can prepare healing all over the nations of the world while we stand and trust in your promise. Lord, hear our prayer. prayer. Omkar Devi Piyanani Ek Janit Put Jesu Christu Ni Shud Atmi Ni Advat No Seva Namas Nkar Karamu Namaskar Veva Namaskar Veva Sem 
मम आराधना करनवा राधे गुरु हिमे पानांत देवरुंदी म सिद्ध करनले सा Sisters and brothers, in the name of God, we now intend to institute and install our well-beloved in Christ, Rosanna Madhuramati Kulendran, who has been called and duly appointed principal of the School for the Deaf and Blind, and for, and for as such as the care of children, their nurture and education. So sacred a responsibility. We pray earnestly that God will grant to His servant Rosanna grace, charge the right, the duties which belong sacred at last. Rosanna, you have been duly chosen and appointed the principal of school for the for the deaf and for the. Do you believe that it is God who has called you? I believe. Will you seek, by the grace of God, to fulfill this sacred work committed to you with faithfulness and diligence, ever seeking to love our Lord with your whole heart and to witness to Him, word and deed? I will so do. The Lord be my help. Will you watch over these schools with faith, hope, love? Humility and courage, conformity with the spirit of the vision of its founders, tradition, honoring its constitution, furthering ideals. I will so do. The Lord be my help. To strive, maintain a high standard of education, formation, integration, demonstrating the love of God as revealed in Jesus, through the inspiration of Holy Spirit. I will so do. The Lord be my help. Maintain and provide for mutual dignity, respect, and understanding among all those work, sharing one another's burden, being encouraged by one another's presence. I will so do. The Lord be community. Please respond to the next question by saying we will want to have a cup of after this service. Those who are here will be invited. Staff, Akala. Will you, the community of the school for the deaf and blind, support and uphold Rosanna, the principal, now and in the days to come? Let us pray for God, the Holy Spirit to bring the gifts that Rosanna need. Commend her well.
Grant, we pray, gracious God. Gift of your grace to your servant, Rosanna, chosen to be principal of the school. Grant that she may well and appropriately discharge her task. And of your great goodness, be, be well pleasing to you, Jesus Christ our Lord. I, Dushanta Rodrigo, by divine permission, 16th Bishop of the Diocese of Colombo, on behalf of the Church of Ceylon and of the Board of Trustees, the school of the Ceylon School for the Deaf and Blind, to hereby institute and commission you, Rosanna Madhuramati Kulendran, as principal of the School for the Deaf and School for the Blind at Rath. The name of the Father and of the Son of the Holy My dear Rosanna, may the blessing of our pilgrim God, the creator, liberator, and comforter, rest upon you and upon your labors undertaken in his name. The Lord give you grace, courage, wisdom, strength, and love grow in his will now and forever. Let us join together and sing Opatry Hymn, found in page number seven. All to Jesus I surrender.
හත්වෙනි පිටුවේ පූජා යදුම දෙවි සම්බිදුනි ශ්‍රේෂ්ඨත්වයද බල පරාක්‍රමයද තේජසද වික්‍රමයද මහිමයද අයත් ඔබතය අද ස්වර්ගයේ පොළවේ සියල්ල ඔබගේ මවනේ සියල් විපුත්වාන්ය ප්‍රවාන්සේ කරේ පාතින ඔබට පිදෙන්නේ ඔබ විසින්ම Hamidun oba samagai Nam wanu mana hamba dena hadawat Nam samidu dena hadawat Devidun samidu tuti put o Sagalowa ha polowa meun karuwane ni bhavnika pitane ni Sama vitaka dima sama tanaka di obra tuti pit yogya apat පාන්ත තුල සුද්ධාත්ත බලයෙන් යුතු පහරංච දේශනා කරන සෑම වයසක දීම හා සෑම දන වහන්සේගේ නාමෙන් හඬ ගසන ප්‍රේමේ සමාජයක් එකට එක් රැස් කරන සාක්ෂිකරුවන් එවි දැන් අපි වහන්සේට එසේ හින අපේ හඬ සුර දූතයන්ගේ හා අග්‍ර සුර සියලු ස්වර්ගයේ සේනාවන්ගේ නාද යමුසු කරමින් අපි ඔබේ නාමයේ මහිමය ප්‍රකාශ කරමු සුද්ධ 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 ආමෙන් සෞ බලත් පියාණෙනි සබවින් ඔබ වහන්සේ පාරිශුද්ධ කෙසුළු දීමන හා කාර්යයත් තුළ ඒ පාරිශුද්ධත්වය බුහාන්තේ මෙන් විශ්ව ඇසුරු වූ ඔබගේ එක ජාතක පුත්‍ර යේසු ක්‍රිස්තුට පරිශුද්ධ වන සේක ඒ දේවත්වය ඉතා ගැඹුරු දේ පහිලි කරන ආසි ලක් සුද්ධාත්ම දෙවිඳුන් වාංච පරිශුද්ධ නාසේ සම්ග සහභාගිත ඔබගේ බස රූපයෙන් උපව මවාලු සේක ඔබ යන පනත් කඩ කළ විනදී පවා උපපත් නොහැර දයබර පිය ඉවරුන් මගින් දැවි අවස්ථාව හා ප්‍රොපේතවරුන් මගින් ඉතිහාසයේ මහත් ක්‍රියා තුලින් ඔබ වහන්සේ පැමිණ කල පැමිණි විට ඔබ වහන්සේ ඔබගේ පුතන් වගේ නැ පැමිණ වහන්සේ අප සේම මිනිසත් බව ගනු දෙලෝට යනු ලැබුවේ ඔබ තුල ඔබේ බස රූපයේ ඔබ වහන්සේ යලි පන කන්වන ධනෙනි ुभागे शरीर රාත්‍රී බෝ තාරදී ප්‍රබන්ධ ගත්තුන් වහන්සේ ඔබට තුති දීමෙන් පස්සුව මෙසේ පවසමින් ප්‍රසිල් දින මෙන් පානය කරන්න සදාද බුලු සත වෙතද පව් කම සදා වග්ගුණ ලබන නව ගිවිස් මේ මාගේ රුද්‍රිය මෙයයි මේ පානය කරන සෑම විටම මාසී වාසි අභිරහස බලවත්ය වාසගේ මා
ability through a for one Coming gay Samadan and it over Samaga Veva. They were done, they were done at
සමිඳුන් හඩ තුති පුදන්න මන්ද දෙවි දානෝ යහපත්ය අපි එක්ව කියමු සියලු බල ඇති දෙවි දුනේ ඔබගේ පුජ්‍ය යේසුස් ක්‍රිස්තු වහන්සේගේ ශරීරය හා රුද්‍රයෙන් අපෝෂණය කිරීම ගැන අපි ඔබට තුති පුදමු වහන්සේ තුලින් ශිවමාන පූජා යාගයක් අපි ඔබ වහන්සේට පූජා වෙමු ඔබගේ ප්‍රසංසාව ආමයි මේ උදේ සාදුවි කියවන්නට දේවා සදන්නට ඒ සුදාත්ම බලයෙන් යුතුව ලෝකයට යවන මෙනව ආමෙන් चलो नैन नुअन एक बवन देवी दून के सामय देवी दून आय तुम आगे पोत जेसु प्रसु पास से पिली बादा वो बोल दिया था कि तुम आगे माय सी प्रेम में जब सिद्ध सतानी तब आगानू लेबे बां चलो बाले ची देवी प्यान आगे दा पुत्र आन आगे दा दुदात प्यान आगे दास रुबत रदी सदा कल पावती Thank you. 